Hi, I'm Donna Sonkin, holistic health coach and chef. I want to thank all of you for coming to my sugar workshop last night. We had so much fun. I realized after I left that I forgot to talk about a very important subject and that is phenylalanine. Phenylalanine is in Diet Coke and it's in some mints and some sugar-free gum. It makes things look shiny um, and it's very harmful. So I'll give you an example. I was giving my sugar talk about four years ago and I started talking about phenylalanine and how phenylalanine directly inhibits the body's natural ability to produce serotonin, which is our feel-good hormone. And a woman got up in class and she looked very sad and she shared with us that she had been on SSRIs, serotonin reuptake inhibitors. Those are those medications, of psychopharmaceuticals, that are for people who are sort of depressed and all of that. So she was taking an SSRI that the doctor had prescribed for about four years. And she was drinking six cans of diet soda a day. And she was just about in tears. She was really upset that her doctor had never asked her uh, what her relationship with phenylalanine, with Diet Coke was. Um, and she couldn't get her meds right. So, you know, the thing is, we take certain foods in our body and they become our body, right? And the phenylalanine directly inhibits the body's natural ability to produce serotonin. So what happens is the body cannot produce the chemicals that it needs to be happy, to keep our mood great, to keep us thin and healthy, right? So anytime you interfere with that, there's a problem. So I encourage you to read your labels to make sure nothing contains phenylalanine. If you're eating or drinking something that contains phenylalanine, stop. It's not good for you. Uh, also, aspartame, which when heated up becomes formaldehyde, um, is in the diet soda and in many things. So, And it's also linked to MS and many other horrible disorders. So what I would say, it's, it's linked to migraine headaches. It's linked to... Um, they took a cross-section of a person's brain that had uh, aspartame and it looked like Swiss cheese. So I would say it burrows these holes in the brain. So you just want to make sure, and it's linked to cancer. So we want to stop any of that. You know, let the body do its own thing. If you're going to drink something, drink water, um, really high quality, glass bottled, or uh, very strongly filtered water. Or green tea, which has... Um, uh, polyphenols, which are antioxidants, so you can drink green tea as long as it's organic. And herbal teas are great. So drink water, green tea, and herbal teas, and not diet soda, and definitely not phenylalanine. So again, thanks so much for attending my sugar workshop. It was a pleasure having you. Um, I look forward to more good times. I look forward to giving you more information. I'm sending you lots of love and Wishes for vibrant health. Mwah. Be well.